Hi, I'm Tony Fleming. Welcome to Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Hey, when you come to Fleming's Ultimate Garage, uh, you'll see when you walk through that we have these hanging tags describing all the cars. Um, you take a look through. I like to kind of run down this a little bit, embellish a little bit upon that, give you a couple of uh, uh, things that I know about the car. For instance, what you won't get from this car, uh, from just walking up to it, is that we have a folder of 25,000 in receipts. That's not counting the price of the car that they paid for, uh, paid for it before they went ahead and had it restored. So it comes with the receipts, and as we walk around and we look at the details on this car, you'll see that uh, uh, so many items have been replaced, replated, or refurbished that essentially you're getting a new 65 Mustang GT. So take a walk around. Raven black paint. You know, uh, one of the great things about looking at paint, you know great paint, because every paint's shiny from far away. You know great paint when you walk up to it and you can see clearly the writing from this Trans Am tire in it right there. And that's what I call a mirror finish paint. This is show waxed and detailed and ready to go. It's got the right GT badging on it. Chrome piece is missing like it's supposed to for a GT. Some of the tidbits to show you uh, that, uh, you know, this is truly a real four-speed GT uh, fastback. A um, couple uh, modifications, this car, this car does have radials on it, and radials are probably one of the greatest inventions to ever happen to cars. You know, the bias ply tire was a very uh, noisy, didn't handle well, and this was really a, a huge leap forward in, uh, in drivability. Great road wheels, that's the correct road wheel on it. By caps, all new emblems, chrome, badges. You know, I don't want to uh, rebuild the whole car for you, but uh, as we walk around, disc brakes. A lot of people forget to ask, does it have disc brakes? Because you know what, today's new car, all have disc brakes. Doesn't matter if it's uh, the least expensive car built or the most expensive. Every car out there uh, has power disc brakes, and most of them have four-wheel disc brakes. This is a little over-restored. You know, that's good and bad. Good is everything in it is top-end, grade-A, good parts, the parts that I like when I drive a car. You know, I want this big aluminum radiator. Nothing for me is worse than a car that bubbles over while you're sitting in traffic or the needle starts to climb. It's a terrible feeling. But in here is all detailed out. You know, these are expensive pieces. This is a polished water pump, polished intake manifold. The carburetor has the coating on it. But this has exhaust manifold still on it to maintain its stockability. So what I do have for the car is the correct finned valve covers and the Cobra air cleaner. So the Monte Carlo bar and export brace is on it. The number is still here. That's a big deal. You know, this is a real GT. It's an A-code car. And you want to see that it says it's 225 horsepower the way it came out of the factory. We also have the door tag for the car. The door tag on the car shows it to be uh, the real deal, a real 225 horsepower, four-speed car. It originally was poppy red. This is black now. They both look great, and you can't go wrong. GT uh, inboard headlights there, fog lights. Everything is just really nice on this car. Check out just the seat belts. The seat belts are these beautiful Mustang pieces. The interior is all new, and it's the pony interior, two-tone pony interior. You've got the fold-down rear seat. But just if you could, paint around the inside of this car for a minute, because all of these panels are new, painted correctly, fresh screws, no shortcuts taken. It does have an upgraded dash in it, auto meter gauges. You have fuel volts, oil pressure, water temperature, speedometer. This has 528 miles since it was restored. 528 miles. I mean, a pedal dress-up package and uh, the heating and air conditioning, the lighter works in the car. It has a cool upgraded Mustang sound system here. And if you want, we could put a digital CD sound system right in there and hide it for you. It comes with, this is pretty cool too. I get so excited about these nice cars. Owner's manual. And uh, this is kind of a, an aftermarket radio and it comes with this here, uh, the manual for it. It's a digital sound system but it's kind of meant to look a little bit stock, too. Let's take a peek in the trunk for a second. Check this out. This is where it just keeps on going. Like, this is restoration stuff. Brand new bezels for the taillights. Somebody went out of their way. You know how many cars we get that don't come with a spare? Almost every one of them. Spare, jack is underneath here. It's dressed in its correct tartan pieces. The tartan plaid, uh, trunk mat, uh, spare uh, jack cover, and the spare tire cover. All the seams are beautiful in here. Everything's just nicely done in black. It's got the correct tips coming out the back. It's got the trumpet tips like an old, but uh, the GT style trip tips coming out of the splash pan. And like it closes nicely. And look at the gaps. Like this is a black car. Black cars show everything. Look down the side of this car. It looks great. 
The red stripe of the dual red line tires look fabulous. These cars just fit well too. Like look at the way this car just, you sit in it right. You can drive like this if you want to. Great wheel. This right here. Let's start and hear what she sounds like. In the world of muscle cars and things like that, 65 Fastback Mustang, absolutely uh, at the top of the list. You know, this is kind of what started a lot of the pony car craze. Matter of fact, it did start the pony car craze. A real four-speed car, uh, beautifully done with documentation, with receipts, and, uh, and just a, a, a top quality job. For Fleming's Ultimate Garage, call us 301-816-1000. We'll be happy to go over this car with you, get you anything you need, and you need to get this in your garage. Call us 301-816-1000.